hello everyone hope you are doing good so in this video we are going to see uh, the most awaited uh, uh, thing that is uh, how to do 15 minutes candle from the abstracts because if you see earlier uh, only 5 minutes candle 10 minutes candle and uh, 30 minutes one hour and one month uh, one day candle will be there and uh, let's see how to do the 15 minutes candle and uh, with this time gap i think many of you might have already done and this is for who has not done that already okay so just for a recap so this is what we have done so far for the past seven series if anyone is watching for this series for the first time please go through the previous videos to how we have come to this stage okay so this one is like uh, for sun tv we are getting the uh, options price for the 700 okay so it is like uh, i can just run this so you should have this uh, access code ready so if it is uh, already done you will get like this and just press enter and uh, you should get like this sun tv 18 september so this is for this month okay and uh, this month you are getting this data okay and actually this is five minutes candle because we have chosen the five minutes candle well let's see how to do this uh, how to convert this into 15 minutes candle data let's uh, see the pandas document okay so there is a function called uh, resample this function will uh, you know convert uh, convenience method you can go through the different definitions just do the resampling of the time series okay so what is the required so you can just go through this frequency conversion and uh, object must have a date time like index date time index period index or time delta index or pay past daytime like values on the on or level keyboard okay so if you see here so this is actually the index okay so index they need it should be the daytime index but uh, in our case the index is the integer number if you see here uh, this is this column is actually the index so you can see like 0 1 2 3 this is integer index so the first step to do convert to 15 minute candle that is for the resampling you need to convert this time uh, index to the timestamp column to the index okay for that what you can do is df dot set index and just give timestamp okay now execute this you should get like this okay but still the index has not changed so what you have to do is just go ahead and give in place equal to true it means it is replacing it so just give s yes. let it run so you got it now okay so here that is the index integer column has changed now this become timestamp and this is your index okay 945 930 12 20 15 everything is there okay so forget about that zero so if there is no value on the day and it should be uh, yeah so only on the 14 something evening something it is from the data because though in the last one so this was not related so uh, we have taken the from date and to date and to date uh, for 30 days you see here the delta days I have the delta days you can refer the previous video how we have already done this well so now let us go for uh, the resampling so for that what you have to do is just assign the same thing as pf equal to pf dot resample and you can just check time just check here so resample rule and uh, there are a lot of other methods which may not be required for us so the thing is we are going to do on 15 minute just type 15 minute okay okay well so what this will do is it will do the resampling we say resampling in the sense that is 1505 1510 15 uh, fitting all these three candles it has converted into one and we need to tell what it has to do it has to do okay say for example if you check here check here uh, yeah, so they are taking it here like uh, series dot resample three minutes here uh, dot sum, which means they are summing up the value. Say for example, you just take this, just take two thousand one thousand zero 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 and all those things. 
they are summing up this value so it become 3 and then they are summing up this 3 uh, 5 4 9 plus two, 3 12 okay so in so we need to show that but actually what we need is here uh, we need to show open high low and close so we need uh, four functions okay so for that uh, pandas having uh, some good magic or uh, whatever you call so you have to use aggregation it means we are giving multiple functions okay multiple uh, functions or uh, things we are giving so like let's take this first we need open okay so open should be actually the first value so whatever open at the first thing uh, will be the open price just give first ensure that you are giving it the same thing okay what i mean is say for example at 1505 whatever the open the 1.30 right that's going to be the open so the next one is open high low close over chelsea so let's go for high so high obviously you need to take the max in this 15 minutes try to take for the max okay and then go for low and uh, this should be minimum that is min these are all pandas function you have to use it rightly high max and min and uh, this open high low it is actually the column name you are specifying you can specify whatever you want okay open high low and then close okay just close should be the last value whatever the last it has closed well we have done this and uh, that's pretty much let us run and see what it is happening okay so we are running this it has done so you got 15 0 15 15 1430, 1445 and everything is coming. Okay. Just we will go through this. Oh my god. There are a lot of NANs. And if you see it is uh, resampling between 2230, 2245 and I am sleeping. Why this is coming? So what we have to do is we just need to get rid of this. For that you can just give df equal to df dot drop NA. I think this we have already discussed about uh, drop NA. But here what we are going to do is if the we can set the threshold okay so th just say thrust equal to 2 and uh, now let's execute this So you can see these are all zeros and uh, the NAs are gone now. Okay, so only the actual candle data will be there. So let us check verify this first. So let's go to pro.abstracts.com. So let's search for 700. 18 September. Sorry. 27 September. So I'll just choose this. This is better. Let's choose 700 P because we are chosen 700 P. Okay. Sorry, 700 C. You can just change it to 700 C. Okay. Perfect. So now this is one day candle let's go to 15 minutes candle okay now let us see so this is actually 15 15 that is 15 15 to 15 30 candle so open 140 high 140 
open on high are equal low is 0.85 and close is 0.90 okay let us compare we are also getting the same 140 140 low is 0.85 and close is 0.90 we got the same thing okay so now let us check for uh, 915 candle so 4405 2.25 2.25 okay so if you go to 915 here 4 4.05 2.25 2.25 okay so it comes absolutely right if it is not coming uh, then you might have done some mistake and uh, this should be working for uh, any other uh, thing also so just you can mention as equity so that uh, it should run for uh, equity i mean the cast uh, price okay so let us verify that so this is for sun tv it should fetch the data for sun tv 632 634 and you got so just type sun tv equity and just go and see for 1515 15. okay 632 634 626 630 you got it right 632 634 636 26 630 dot 65 you can check uh, verify it okay just do a cross check and comparison and you should be able to do it well that's pretty much with uh, how to do this this thing and since many are asking about uh, how to write this to this uh, excel because uh, the google finance has depreciated that api so let me show how to write this to the uh, excel sheet okay so for that what you can do is uh, just create an object writer equal to pd dot, PD dot Having 2016 or something, you can 2013. I think you can use Excel yes, yes, otherwise it should be Excel as only. Okay, uh, that's pretty much simple. So now write a equal to this one and they can give df dot to Excel. Here you need to give you a writer, and here if you want, you can specify the name as well. Okay, say for example, just type and just type. This, this is the sequence so that you make sure that you are saving the file so you have to keep this that's it just go ahead and execute this file enter it is fetching the data and then it will write to the candle data called 15 minute candle.xlsx This is because uh, we have converted the timestamp and uh, the number formatted is shown later. So what you can do is just add a data and format. Okay, just queue. You can just queue this. Watch. Just a second. You can check here. Pandas Excel Writer data and format. So what to queue I pick? So just uh, check and whatever you want uh, you can use. I think this should work. If not, let's see. Okay, we are still getting this error. So let us see. So there is no problem with the reset index. So just comment it out. Actually, the problem could be is because of uh, the Excel engine which the Pandas is using. Say basically uh, it will use OpenPy Excel. Okay. Uh, so what you can do is just go ahead and uh, change the uh, I mean install the engine so that is XLSX writer 
I'm not telling you much about how to install this package. This and all we have already discussed. So just go ahead and install this package and uh, click OK and then just go ahead and execute this. Okay. So it should get like this. I guess this should work. Perfect. So this has worked and just go here and you can see this. So you got this. So you can expand. So it is like August 27, 9.15, 9.30, everything it is coming. You can change. So this one is uh, coming as data. So it is up to you like uh, whatever name you want. Okay. So say for example, if you want to run this for multiple stocks, you can just uh, put it in the loop. Okay. And then uh, the sheet name, you can just change it. So that for all the stocks, it will run in few minutes, maybe within one minute or something, it will get it executed. Maybe let me show you the demo for that as well. Uh, I'm just giving a stock list. Okay. Pipo and uh, Sun TV. Okay. So it's up to you. I mean, you can make it uh, whatever you want. You can update whatever the stocks you needed. Okay. So let us do like this. So we are going to use the for loop now. So after this for symbol in stock list. So remaining everything is same because we use the same variable symbol. And uh, here uh, the sheet name should be symbol. Okay. And ensure that you have closed the sheet uh, while the Python program is running. Otherwise you will get the error message. Okay. I will show you in the upcoming videos uh, how to run this even when the excel file is opening as well. Fine. Now let's go ahead and do this. And uh, first it is doing for the Wipro. And then it should do for the Sun TV as well. So both as done. And just go ahead and see this 15 minute candle.xls. So you got only Sun TV. The reason is because of this we have made it like this. So what you can do is just put it this outside of the Excel sheet. Okay, because we are uh, insulating every time. So that is the reason it is not coming. It is re overwriting. Okay. So at the end we are saving the file. So now go ahead and execute. So now we are running, I should close this. Yeah. So before I close, it has thrown the error. This is the reason I said you should not have the file open. Okay. So let's rerun. So first the pro and then Sun TV. Both are done. Let's see how it does. It does both. Okay. So it has the pro and it has Sun TV. Perfect. So similarly you can have for the multiple uh, in one shot so uh, you just put it in the stock list and you can get it okay that's all for the day and uh, soon i will post about uh, either how to get uh, writing the indicators like uh, sma ema or something or otherwise i will go ahead and do the uh, web socket okay uh, someone has asked me about how to do the commodity uh, commodity is nothing uh, it is just simple just change the in type to mcx uh, and all those things here uh, you will be using uh, what is that the inch type in the utility function here nse fo right instead of that you have to use mcx uh, whatever it is mcx indexer what the future option and then you have to provide the right uh, the symbol name whatever it is silver or crude or whatever it is you can give and uh, the remaining everything is same you will get the same data okay well, thank you so much for watching. Please do uh, support, keep uh, supporting us and uh, do share the videos, subscribe to this and uh, click on the notification symbol as well. Thank you so much. Good day.